So when I was in about, let's see, fifth grade, I was uh, playing WWF wrestlers with my stepbrother. And we thought it'd be a good idea to use the pillows as chairs. You know, hit him with the chair! That sort of thing. So we were doing that. We were whacking each other with pillows under the guise of being burly wrestle men. I decided that I was going to do a 360 corkscrew chair whack with the pillow. <laughs> and I was really going to show him. And uh, I had to do it off the couch to get the right amount of leverage. <laughs> so here's little fifth grade me spinning 360 plus degrees off of a two foot high couch with the pillow in my hand, ready to whack my stepbrother. <laughs> and I land, and I keep spinning, and my foot stays still, and I fall on the ground, and there's a pain in my knee. And I've had my knee get stuck before. This time was different. This time there was a huge bulge in the side of my pants. Uh, where there's usually not a kneecap. And when there should have been a kneecap, there was just kind of a divot. <laughs> there was no kneecap there. I started yelling for help. And my mom came in, put her hand up to my knee. Meanwhile, my stepbrother's just like, especially after the, the paramedics come and they use their clothing shears to shear off my clothing, and I actually see the thing in the flesh, and it, it is nasty. Uh, the paramedics are trying to ask me, they're, they're just trying to keep me calm, they don't actually they're obviously at my house, so they don't need to know my address once they're already there. But they're asking me my address and things like that. And I'm just like, I don't fucking know. Ask my mom. Was not happy at that point. So they're wheeling me away in the stretcher thing. I'm in the ambulance, and there's Ludacris, the rapper, playing in the ambulance for some reason. I grew up in Miami. There's just rap music playing in ambulances, I guess. <laughs> That's just how we do in Miami. And uh, I started rapping along with it because I knew all the words. Because I had Ludacris's uncensored word of mouth with an F album in fifth grade. Which, in hindsight, doesn't seem so appropriate. I'm just rapping all the curse words, and the paramedics are like, Damn! <laughs> and cursing at our paramedics when they're asking him his address. They probably just wanted to leave me like that on the ground. <laughs> I would have. We get to the hospital, and this is the first and only time I ever fell for that trick. He said, all right, we're going to pop it back in on, on three. One, two. And I felt like I had given birth through my knee in that moment. <laughs> That's the story about how my leg <laughs> came out. <laughs> <laughs>